What's going on, guys? Jada Black here. Shout out to everyone that's tuning in. I want to talk about Antonio Brown again. Apparently, this guy decided to post himself doing things <laughs> with women on his Snapchat. You know, I, you know, the fact that he still uses Snapchat, you know, just shows y'all that he's using it for nefarious reasons. You know, I, I had a thought. I said, you know, Snapchat is becoming Tumblr before they filtered everything. Y'all know how Tumblr was when they had all that X-rated stuff. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That was the place a lot of uh, a lot of uh, the only Insta IG models used to go to before before. I would say only fans took off like they would post, you know, certain type of content there. Right. Uh, but anyway, that was a while ago. I don't know what Tumblr's doing now, but apparently Antonio Brown decided that he wanted to show the world what his activities are. And one of the activities was with his on and off again, girlfriend, baby mama, Chelsea. The fact that this female has stayed with Chelsea I mean, this fact this female Chelsea has stayed with Antonio Brown for as long as she has, even though this dude puts her through a lot of stuff. It just shows you the power of fame and money. I think she would have been left him if, you know, she felt like she would be losing out. This dude done kicked her out of the house. He's embarrassed her. He sleeps with other women while he's still, you know, with her. And she, you know, she stays with him. She gets back with them because I don't know if it's a fear of being single. The fact that they have she got all them kids by him now. Or just the, the fact that women love drama. Women love, you know, these dysfunctional relationships. You know, if Antonio Brown was a little bit more normal, uh, I think that she probably would have been left, to be honest with you. I, I, I do. Now, Antonio Brown has, you know, he loves attention. He will do and say whatever he has to to get y'all to notice what he's up to. And recently nobody has really cared what antonio brown had going on you know he would troll tom brady to get people to talk about him and when that didn't that stopped working now he's embarrassing his baby mother once again to where she has to put out statements it's clear that this guy doesn't really care much about her but she is the mother of his kids and it's better i guess for him to keep her uh, i guess it's cheaper right now again antonio brown will do whatever and say whatever he needs to do in order to get y'all to notice him. That's how he has been for years. People try to say it was a concussion. No, it's not a concussion. It's who he is. This guy had gold teeth taking a team photo when he was in college. So, I mean, that's just, that's his personality. It's always been his personality. It's always been, I don't know why people are surprised by that. And again, Chelsea has stayed with him, I think, because of who he is and, and his money. You know, if he was somebody else, you know, she probably would have been left. She would have been left. Let's take a look at this article from Urban Isles. Antonio Brown is trending on social media for the wrong reasons again today. On Tuesday, Snapchat and Twitter erupted after the ex-NFL player seemingly shared photos of his uh, eggplant on social media on the social media app. At least one photo was of him and his baby mother, Chelsea Chris, who has since issued a strong statement regarding the embarrassing images According to TMZ, a rep for Snapchat says the account has since been suspended for violating its terms and conditions. Now, this is uh, the message she has here. I'm going to read this message that she has. She put on her uh, IG story. It says, I'm very well aware of what's being posted on Snap. I'm not in control of his actions. I have asked multiple times. To have this part of our past relationships to remain private, but he refuses. I have reported his page and all the pictures. Unfortunately, Snapchat is allowing him to repost. I am very sorry for any of your kids that follow him and used to look at him as a role model. I do not condone these actions as you are aware I have kids involved as well. So she's making a plea to the followers of antonio brown which is commendable you know she's a parent and she wants other parents to know what she uh understands and he's putting up images of him she's playing the good girlfriend you know I i've said this about a lot of women who date men like antonio brown they have this good and bad complex right 
You got women that will date a guy that they know is to is know his he considered to be toxic or dysfunctional, and they will date him anyway, have children with him, make excuses for him, right? Put out statements condemning his actions, making a plea to the people because at the end of the day, it's all about painting themselves as the good one. But I I, I just I look at her and I look at how this dude has treated her and why she continues to go back and forth with him. Like he has a child by another woman who broke up with him and never went back. But she does. Even when Antonio Brown was like, I'm no longer dating white women. I believe that was in 2020, right? <laughs> Going into 20 I'm done with white women. Ain't nobody said. And nobody believed him. <laughs> That's Antonio Brown, man. But she stayed with him through that. Kicking her out the house, right? Embarrassing her. And she stayed because there are women out here who like the like to be the good one in a relationship and make excuses for the guy that they are with and talk about how, you know, she's a parent and and how she wants to protect others from the, you know, their spouse's actions. And it's like, well, you can do that by separating yourself from that person. That's how you can do, you know, but you stay with them. You still continue to have children with him and it's only going to enable his behavior. Now, again, it might be very difficult, you know, for her to, to leave Antonio Brown. But the thing is, is that you can't keep making excuses for his behavior. At some point, you're going to have to say to yourself, what's important? Is it the social status of being his girlfriend or fiance? Or is it your peace of mind knowing that you're done with the relationship? In the photo of herself posted just before her statement, Chelsea appears to be sporting a huge diamond engagement ring. There were speculations in December of last year that Brown popped the question to Chelsea and she said yes, although neither of them have has ever confirmed their engagement because it's not an engagement ring. It's like a uh, it's probably like a um, forgiveness ring. This is not the first time Antonio Brown is going too far on social media. Last year, he went live while hanging out at a pool where he exposed himself to tens of thousands of his fans, uh, turning into uh, tuning into his live feed. He also previously shared a photo of his former teammate Tom Brady's ex-wife, Giselle Bunchen on Snapchat, sparking outrage from fans of the quarterback. Again, that was to draw y'all in, you know, but ultimately, you know, Antonio Brown is a guy who's his window is closing in regards to getting people to notice him. And he's doing things like this to spark people's interest. But at the end of the day, how many of these things you can do? He's now putting pictures of himself and Chelsea, the woman who has been his ride or die. Like Chelsea has been his rider. Like Chelsea done been there. He done embarrass her. She goes right back. Chelsea has, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It don't matter what he does. Chelsea's going to go right back to him. All right. No matter what he does. And he knows this. He knows that by putting out Snapchat, she not going nowhere. She put out this statement just so people would stop contacting her and, and commenting on to her. This is what the statement, this to me looks like damage control for him not herself even though she's there you know exposed with him this was all about justifying why she's still with him listen if you're okay with him putting out stuff with you in it that you might like that then you might as well just say it because that's what it's coming off as it's coming off as you know he put that up and she's struggling off like yeah so what you know because she don't want to look like She's condoning it. And she wants to put that statement out to say, I feel bad for the fact that y'all children are following him. It's like, what, what is that? <laughs> you know, then you, then you got a picture of yourself with this ring. It's like Chelsea. We, we know that you're, you're just like him. You know, you're no different than he is. You know, a lot of these women get with these guys. Y'all think that they're different. No, they're just the same. They're just the same. And Antonio Brown knows this. He knows she ain't going nowhere. He knows she ain't going nowhere. So shout out to everybody that's tuning in. Make sure y'all like this video and share it. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And I'll see y'all in the next one.